back to the Crip Mac, man. Tell me what you think about Crip Mac, bro. And the story, everything. That's- from what I hear, I don't know. I don't know. know what I'm saying, I don't, from what I didn't hear, from I'm going to base off only what I heard because I wasn't there. I'm not. Know what I'm saying, yeah. So I can only speak off what have been put on the internet and right. the video I saw of him responding to what happened. Right, right. He said they, they called him up saying he was false flag and found the old picture or old video or something with him hanging with. You know what I'm saying, homie from sixty. Oh. Okay. But this was this before he even got put on, you know what I'm saying, from you know what I'm saying? Fifty the fifth street. Yeah. From, supposedly. Right. So, so how is he false flagging if he wasn't a member of nothing when he was hanging, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. With the homies from sixty. And then if he was hanging with the homies from sixty way before he started claiming, you know what I'm saying, got put on for fifty fifth street. Even after he got put on fifty fifth street, he'd be down there nip stoke cleaning up. Oh, okay. So, I didn't know that. So why? So what? You know what I'm saying? So why wasn't he? You know what I'm saying? Put in check a discipline then. Right. Right. You know what I'm saying? I feel like the man getting a little fame versus y'all. You know what I'm saying? Versus nigga from this set. You know what I'm saying? And that's a and that's 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 that's, that's the toxic part of old homies that don't know what I'm saying. That feel like if they not directly involved, they don't want you to succeed. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And they'll, and they'll let. You know what I'm saying? They'll let that kind of go down instead of protecting him. They the ones hurting them. Man. Then they can they can spiral out of control into something else. Cause you know what I'm saying? The homie from City can be can get offended by that. Why y'all whooping him for cause he, cause he hanging with us? Or cause he did hang with us. Y'all yeah. all y'all, but everybody under the neighborhood umbrella. Right. The neighborhood. So you got bloods that's, that's from neighborhood. Right, right, right. So y'all wanna just whoop this man. I feel like those are, they want to show the world that you know what I'm saying, we'll whoop this nigga. Y'all that y'all cause people have become to love this man as, as a, a public figure. Man, that's true, bro. That's true. So why would you want to jump on this man? Is that the fake love? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, okay. That's why that fake love right there. Because people really love him. If you really love him, you'll be happy for him. Right, right. Man, we know you need the security, you know what I'm saying? Because most of the videos, he be on by himself. Yeah, he do. You know what I'm saying? So at some point, this man get to you go know, there doing shows. Y'all should be in security. Not nobody y'all finna jump on the man because he ain't going by a flaky law that really, you know what I'm saying, that's really inconsistent. Okay. I'm going to whoop, gonna whoop you because you were hanging with you no know, nigga from the 60s. Even with way before you got put on 55th. Man. But after you got put on 55th, you can, you can go down there and hang with Nip at the store, though. Okay. And clean up. And we ain't, there ain't no problem with that. There wasn't no problem until this man started getting, you know what I'm saying, these views start running up and people start calling that man's phone. Man, and he put the hood on like that. So the next man can stand up and say, I'm yeah. 55th, too. So yeah. I, that's the our community, though, bro. What though, and that's the part I, I work on. And I, and I see, when I see ain't nobody trying to work on that, yeah. conversations are limited. Hey, what's up? You know what I'm saying? And that's it. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because another thing, I don't even talk about you ain't. I don't want to hear about no stepping on nobody. You mad at nobody. You know what I'm saying? You, you mad at them Trump supporters? <laughs> right. How many Republicans you mad at? How many of them you stepped on? We ain't talking about none of that. Okay. You know what I'm saying? It, it, it's, unpro- it's, un- it's kind of productive. You still talking about what the man around the corner doing. Yeah, yeah. That's crazy, bro. So, man, we touched on the... Uh, the- the clothing, we touched on the events, man. Let's 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 get to your music, man. How long you been, you know what I'm saying, putting it down in the music, you know, and doing your thing with that? I've been rapping since I was like eleven years old when I started writing. Okay. The first group I was in, like me and my partner Clayville and his cousin, you know what I'm saying, Don Juan. We had yeah. a, a group called the Clicksters. Mm-hmm. We had a song number one on the countdown with DJ Dirt with DJ and the KMJJ. Okay. You know what I'm saying? We didn't, did, we didn't open up, you know what I'm saying, UGK when they came here for the convention center. Yeah. Back in 90, 96. Okay. 90, 96. Okay. We opened up UGK when they came Oh, here. yeah. Okay. Oh, man. You know what I'm saying? So I've I been in the mix, you know what I'm saying, here and now. Hit up, you know what I'm saying, hit red tape here. This uh, learning process. You know what I'm saying? So now, how the game has changed, and I'm more wiser, but you know what I'm saying, I'm independent. You know what I'm saying? People look at it like, well, he ain't got four, five thousand views on, on stuff, but I own it. Right, you ain't everything, lying. everything. You know, I, I, you know, I own the masters of everything I got. You know what I'm saying? Right. Everything that you know, I, I had exclusive rights to the, the, the beat something I have and the publishing. Okay, you know what I'm saying I don't have to call nobody. You know what I'm saying? The answer to no one when it comes to my music. Man, you know man, I was seeing the video, man, and I seen new new in there, man. Man, yeah, speak on Nunu, yeah. man, and uh, the type of spirit she had. Because I heard, like, she used to do a lot of stuff for the community as well, man. And I, when I seen your video, I was like, man, that's she in this video. I don't even, I don't even, 
I don't you know what I'm saying. I, I you know what I'm saying. I know her mother. Her mother cool. You know what I'm saying. Yeah. And her mother, my friend, so I, I don't really push the video as much as I would if she was still alive. I got you, bro. You know what I'm saying, and it's, it's a thin line I walk, and they go back to my, they go back to integrity. You know what I'm yeah. saying, I got you, bro. You know what I'm saying? Cause I don't want, I don't want, I, I would hate to offend anybody. You know what I'm saying? Well, you, you showing the video, but you know what I'm saying? Cause I ain't showing it for no clout. I got I, you. I really miss her. You know what I'm saying? And to the point where we were cool. You know what I'm saying? I just, I used to date her friend. You know what I'm saying? Nunu okay. was a hustler. Nunu, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. She did her thing or whatever, but you know what I'm saying? And but she was a good person. You know, she you needed some shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. She gonna come through. You know what I'm saying? If she if she rocking with you like that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Our fashion. You know what I'm saying? Right after that video. She hit me up. Some dude, they saw the video. They called some dude from uh, from East Texas. Okay. Wanted her to come out on the video. She hit me up. You know what I'm saying? I still got the, the inbox in my phone. Oh, man. I'm like, man, go and do it. She's like, I don't know if I want to do that. You know what I'm saying? Do it. Like, they offered me such and such amount of money. Yeah. You know so I'm like, that's money. You know what I'm saying? That's the money. One way you start like that, you open that door. That's, you know what I'm saying? That's a whole career that you even think you'll have. That's a door opening. You know what I'm saying? I don't want nothing. Yeah. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Oh, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But, you know what I'm saying? Why is she in the video? She come through. You know what I'm saying? But I, the prequel to that video, uh -huh. I have a prequel to that video where we at the hotel room. Nunu, the only female in the room shooting dice. Well, you know so what you saying? got some more footage. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, oh, but it's man. quick. Yeah. You know, I told her, like, man, come on, do the other scene. I'll make sure you get, you know what I'm saying? Get the, get a whole the whole scene of you. Okay. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, she in the, you know what I'm saying? At the suite, we had the, the prequel. You know what I'm saying? She only one over there with the, about six, seven of them shooting dice. She only female over there shooting dice. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's real, bro. That's real. Slay on, man. Yeah. Slay on, you know what I'm saying? Slay on, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Say, so, hey, speak on your uh, your latest jam, man. Neighborhood. You know what I'm Neighborhood saying? Neighborhood is the latest one I got the, the visual to. Okay, I got okay. another with my, you know what I'm saying? With, with, my, with my partner, Pretty Girl Famous. She, that's, that's on the hook on Neighbors. Okay, okay. I got one, we got one called Vibe too, with me and her on now. Right. We ain't did the visual to it yet. But Neighbors, I got a shirt. One of my, you know what I'm saying, under my brand, they call neighbors. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You see it right up. Here go, here go some of the shorts. Oh, that's player, bro. That's player. Right up. Yeah, you know yeah, yeah. Okay, man. So I'm like, I'm gonna do the song. You know what I'm saying? And I'm, I'm, I'm gonna use the, the Pyro Love beat, which is the original Computer Love beat. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I don't know, don't know dissing, but I always love the beat. Right, right. You know what right. I'm saying? I'm like, I'm gonna do. You know what I'm saying? That beat so far. I want to be able to listen to that on some on some on some crip music though. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Cause I ain't gonna really just be bumping that. So I want to be yeah. able to do this yeah, down this beat with some stuff I'm familiar with. Right, right. You know what I'm saying? And at the same time, shout out a lot of the homies that that I know. That people that a lot of them are locked up. A lot of you know what I'm saying the homies that passed. I want to you know what I'm saying keep their name alive. Yeah. So that inspired me to you know I did I wrote the song in jail. You know what I'm saying? Okay. When I was locked up, but I never you know what I'm saying I was like I ain't gonna produce it. Okay. And I start finding pieces of the song from, you know what I'm saying, from my tablet. I post it on Facebook. I'm like, man, I'm, I'm going to go record it. Okay. Hit, you know what I'm saying? Hit uh, Lil' One Up, like old production. Yeah, yeah. Man, kill the beat in about two days. Man, you got Send some. It back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm talking about, you know what I'm like, I'm going to come sit in. You know what I'm I want you to make it while I'm sitting in. He's like, all right. Before I even get over there, he sent me something back. Like, they ain't need nothing else. Oh, okay. You know what I'm saying? That's what's up Some right of that thing, man. I'm put it down. Yeah, yeah. Man, you doing your thing, bro. Like, I'm pretty sure people seeing this interview, they like, man, this dude got clothes. This dude do throw events. He got he got jams, man. Man, what you think about uh, a lot of the hip hop artists, man, these young guys, man, and a lot of them, you know, getting killed and stuff like that, man. What what's your take on that, bro? Like, it's like one every week out damn there, man. We feeding the monster. Yo. When I when I say that, I mean that, that means that if we continue to brew, you know what I'm saying, that music once it's uploaded, they're going to feel like that's what they had to rap about to get their views up. Okay. If we stop, you know what I'm saying, listening to that like that, yeah. man, say rap about something else. Right, right. So I salute my partner, you know what I'm saying, and Brown. And Brown said, don't bring me no song. You know what I'm saying? He DJ in the club. He, well, yeah, he DJ mainly, you know what I'm saying, style, but he, he DJ party too. Okay. Like, I ain't, I ain't playing no song in the club. This is another artist. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's, a, that's setting the tone. I got you. You know what I'm saying? Cause it, 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 what, 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 how far is too far? Right. And to the point now, I almost, I'm, I'm ready to see a person get gunned down for real in a rap music video. You know. They're going to be the next step. Yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? 
Yeah, they definitely pushing the line, man, on that, man. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? It's like, over there, there a lot of these people, fathers that I know, I, I could not be in the mix a lot. You know what I'm saying? Like, a lot of these the fathers I know, they, they fathers know each other. But yeah. they beefing. Yeah, 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 I know exactly what you're talking about. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah. We can't, uh, we got to come to the table. I've been wanting to holler at T. Wynn about it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. The other home, you know what I'm saying? Hey, let, we need to do, do we need to get the father to articulate, they don't know how to articulate. You know what I'm saying? Not you know what I'm saying, saying he's less of a father, but if you can't articulate the importance of we'll help you. Right. We'll sit down and tell, you know what I'm saying? I've been now. Yeah, yeah. Now we're going to help me even go to jail and be cool with some of the same family members. So let's be cool with them now. Right, right. Because I'd have been in jail when it's going on. Yeah. All it could have been a boy, you get right in the jail, go down the road. Now we um, we got to be cool with each other, got all of them street parts, because we, we, can't, we can't get our number back, you know what I'm saying? Homies from down south, or people from down south. Right, so right. So we got to stick together now. Okay, okay. That's counterproductive. Yeah. And we can bring that same thing out we gonna, here. We're going to let, we gonna let Steve Prater, you know what I'm saying, and other, you know what I'm saying, warden over a jail, make us, make us get along. But, I, you know what I'm saying, the parents should make us get along on the street. Right, right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it should have more influence. You know, we don't have to wait to get down there, you know what I mean? And they get, oh, that nigga dog trying to talk down. That's what I. That's some of the feedback I get from other people. They don't tell me that to my face. I, some people, look, every time they be talking, I got somebody come back and let me know what they've been said. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Keep shaking your hand like it's all right. You know what I'm saying? I yeah. not know how you feel, but yeah. I ain't telling nobody nothing wrong. I'm trying to save everybody. Right, right, right. I'm just a nobody. <laughs> trying to tell man, everybody. man, you doing? Yeah, I man, I know I'm, I'm skipping subjects, man. But y- y'all did a Southern Soul Show here too, huh? Yeah, my boy Ralph Jackson. Yeah, yeah. So you be into that, that, yeah. that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You just yeah. overall business man, man. Yeah, my partner wanted to do it. You know what I'm saying? He watched me hat. You know what I'm saying? I, he... Okay, man. Say, man. So tell the people, man. You know what I'm saying? How they can look you up. You know what I'm saying? Because I know when everybody see this, they're gonna be like, you know, because we we got a lot of Dallas support that we get, man. They're gonna be like, who is this dude? Head trying to box go. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Head trying to underscore clothing on Instagram. Head trying to clothing. Slash Facebook on Facebook. And the website coming soon. You know what I'm saying? Here's trying to close. I got the site. I just ain't I just ain't published it yet. I've been getting it, you know what I'm saying? Redid and revamped. Already, man. I told you Black Houston, man. I want to shout out my boy, you know what I'm saying? My boy be cooling. You know what I'm saying? Tweet it off. You know what I'm saying? Tashaski Johnson from the road. Y'all know this shoe, Gallery. You know what I'm saying? He ain't even seen the cup yet. <laughs> I want to go get some. I celebrate Black Houston, man. Go deal with some local. We are black history. You know what okay, I'm okay, man. Local owners and, and business owners. I'm, I, you know, I see a lot of that in Shreveport, man. There's a lot of black business owners, man, doing their thing, man. Got to get their customer service up, though. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah. Bro, yeah. got to get their customer service up, you know what I'm saying? Right, right. You can't jump in the business. I got a business now. It's coming with so much more. It, yeah, if yeah. I, you know what I'm saying? I make my, man, I, you, you hit me up, I got to respond. If I can't do it, I'm going to tell you I, I don't have it. I'm not there right now. I got to tell you something. Right. You know what I'm saying? Because, you know what I'm saying? To, that's a part of communication. Yeah. You got to yeah. have communication skills. You know what I'm saying? In the business of selling anything. Yeah. They should listen to you, man, because you've been doing, like you said, since 05. Yeah, so, yeah. So, I come up, when I come out with the 05, I, come, I go right to it. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? My mother, you know what I'm saying? For my mother passed, she, you know what I'm saying? She ported me. She helped. You know what I'm saying? At one point, I got a story. I, people next door, I had, we had got a, a package that ordered the T-shirt. People next door, they were the UPS delivered it to their to they address, and they kept it. Right. My mama knew I wanted to go over there and whoop them people. You know what I'm saying? My mama, you know what I'm saying? My mama took me, you know what I'm saying, drove me to, you know what I'm saying, Harry High. So I went, you know what I'm saying, to keep me from, you know what I'm saying, getting into them people about that. Yeah. I just came home. You know what I'm saying? That's something I'll never forget. My mama, my mama had been up all night, you know what I'm saying, driving the cab. And she, the next morning, she still took me to, you know what I'm saying, to Dallas. Oh, man. You know okay. Yeah. So I knew I couldn't, you know what I'm saying? I, I, I couldn't fail. Man. You know what I'm saying? Well, that's it right there, bro. That's 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 real right there. That's real. Like, that's the story. And then that's what uh, keeps you going. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Already, man. Say, man, I appreciate you for the interview, man. You know what I'm saying? It's Charlie Mo TV, bro. Hey. No, you, we, wanna know, you know what I meant? Yeah, yeah. One love, homie. Same to you. Yeah.